Hello, I've had several people ask me about my desktop because I did a recent switch. If you've been watching my videos, I switched to KDE for a little while and it didn't work out because of compositing and screen recording. I had some issues, but that's another thing. And I came back to GNOME and I've had some people ask me if I went back to KDE and I didn't. So I just wanted to show you guys this cool little extension for GNOME that makes your desktop look like this. So I've always had the panel on the top and the dash on the side as a panel, but I kind of got used to how KDE was with everything at the bottom. And I found a neat little extension that lets you make it look like this. If you don't know what extensions are, I have this video here, what are GNOME extensions and how do I get them? and I'll put a link in the top corner here for that. Um, if you go to the extensions page where you can add and remove them, it is called dash to panel. So you just search it, click it, and then turn it on. Really easy. Go check out that video if you wanna know how to do that. So if I open up my GNOME tweaks, my good GNOME tweaks, go to extensions, I have a few extensions, but I can see, no, wait, I passed it, dash to panel. So if I turn this off, it goes back to how it was. Actually, it was like this. This is how it always was. If you look at all my old videos till I switched to KDE and I just really got used to having it on the bottom. So I got rid of dash to dock, which basically just makes the panel appear here permanently. So I got rid of that. Uh, installed dash to panel and it moves everything down here and if you go into the settings there are a lot of settings that you can do to make it look however you want so it's really cool you can customize the sizes you can customize uh, I don't know if you can see on the video the little bars underneath when a windows open the little green bar and if I open multiple it's multiple little bars underneath so it's really cool what you can do with it and I really like it a lot so I guess this is a bit of a shout out to dash to panel. I really, really like it. You can move your clock wherever you want. So it's the same menus as before, just arranged in a different way and kind of looks like how KDE does, but with the bonus of still using GNOME and still having the interface that I like. So yeah, I wish I could have stuck with KDE, but it is what it is. It didn't work out. If one day I do find a fix for the graphics glitches, then you never know. Maybe I will go back to KDE, but until then, I got to stick with, with GNOME because my screen recording, if it's not clean, if it's flickering and everything, that's not acceptable for me. I'm not going to put that stuff on YouTube. I don't like seeing that stuff. So yeah, GNOME it is. So. In case you guys were wondering, yes, I'm still using GNOME. It just looks like KDE. And that's how I did it. All right. Short little video, but that's all I want to say. So super duper quick thank you to my Patreon producers, Carlos Argnos, Carl George, Matt, Kit, and Says. Thank you so much for contributing. Head on over to patreon.com slash dorian dot slash if you want to throw me a couple bucks a month. Help me out and help me contribute to the Linux community by contributing to my channel. All right, guys, till next time, bash on.